What is up there everyone, it's the Gardener, Gamer Tech here, and today I wanted to talk about whether the COD community is turning people away. Because I've had this experience recently where just generally the COD community has just been turning me off the game more and more the more I sort of feel involved with the community. And partly it's actually just from people that still play the games. I was playing Modern Warfare 2 yesterday, and just the way some people were playing it, it's like... I was going in, I was doing fairly well, but it seemed that every time I was getting close to having that amazing game, I would just run into something that was just so horrible in the way some people playing, getting noob tubed, getting people jump shot, drop shot, panic knifing was horrible, and just the way that some people decide to play the game. And it's just the whole thing with the community is that it just sort of has gone towards this kind of selfishness in the community that everyone wants themselves to do well and I suppose that's kind of what gaming is you are driven to have your own performance do well and you're not necessarily regarding what everyone else is doing and how that affects them and I suppose in some way that is just a flaw with gaming is that while someone's doing well and having fun someone is going to be annoyed or upset and I suppose that's something we're never going to avoid and even like the community on YouTube has just really gone downhill and it's just not as fun as it seemed to used to be. Back in the day of like Modern Warfare 3, you didn't have all the YouTube drama videos that everyone seems to be doing now and all that kind of stuff. Trolling was just sort of beginning and was kind of funny only because it was new and no one had really started and it wasn't the big thing and now everyone is doing it. It was just sort of a little fun thing that some people used to do but now of course for me the novelty wore off ages ago and I just don't like those kind of videos anymore. I don't mind people messing around with their friends and just trolling their own friends who see it as a joke, but it's people that go around just specifically to piss people off to get reactions. It's like that doesn't hold any entertainment value for me anymore. And a lot of the drama alert stuff, it's just like really, if you look at COD community like a barrel of fish, these people are just saying, hey, he's got the same barrel as you. Ooh, that's not. It's like a p bunch of old women. It's like, no, he didn't say that. It's so annoying. It's like, for goodness sake, please if you're not going to talk about anything sensible just don't bother talking at all we don't want to hear this and we don't want to get involved i'm always slightly worried about growing on youtube because eventually you get to that point where people are going to start trying to do youtube drama about you and it's just like do i really want to put up with this can i really be bothered i'm no by no means going to quit youtube i do enjoy doing it but it's like is growing worth it if people are only just going to spend the whole time trying to leech you or just trying to screw you over is it really worth it and I think it's just come down to this selfishness but in actual t when I think about it it's almost a general thing around the world where it just seems that everyone will do absolutely anything to get a foot up on someone else and I think it's kind of pitiful in a way that we consider ourselves the greatest species and the most intelligent species on earth and yet we're just constantly trying to destroy each other. It's like, why? What are we doing? Although admittedly, I'm a bit sidetracked from the topic of the COD community, but it's just sort of a general thing. It's just like, why Oh, can we not just try and work together? But admittedly, it seems slightly ironic that I would be saying this on a community channel, but it's just something about the community that has just sort of really put me off the game because it's like, I don't, I'm not sure if I really want to be involved with COD as much anymore, or at all, because the community has just gone downhill. Although I will admit, the people that I talk to on YouTube now, they are some awesome people, and I'm so glad that Boston asked me to be our director on this channel, because it means that I can actually help and try and help other people, and it's something that is very good that people do just want to help on YouTube. But actually, I've just found in general, Call of Duty, I felt myself just gradually becoming more detached from Call of Duty and wanting slightly less to do with it. Black Ops 3, watching all the trades and stuff is like, yeah, it looks like an alright game, but it just doesn't take my fancy. And I think it's partly just, I don't necessarily feel the need to be involved with Call of Duty in the community. And actually, I found myself just enjoying games like Battlefield more. I feel more involved in the Battlefield community just because I prefer the community. Admittedly, there is still quite a lot of toxicity with elitism in that community. But I haven't noticed it as much as I used to. It doesn't seem to be as bad. And people in the Battlefield community seem to actually want to make the game generally better. And not just wanting what they do to be better in the game. And I just think that is something that has drawn me much more towards that game. Because people don't care about, oh, is quickscoping going to be good or is it going to be bad. They just want, look, we just want a fun game to play that we can all play and enjoy. 
not trying to get themselves the best thing for their YouTube channel. They just want the game to be enjoyable for everyone and as many people as possible. But anyway guys, I want to hear what you all think because I have some pretty, I have to say fairly strong opinions about this. But some of you may think differently and I really want to see what you guys have to say. I'm going to thank Boston Strong for allowing me to be a director and upload to this channel. It does mean a lot and I will be trying to put out regular content for this channel. Of course, I am planning on doing some like live stuff, doing challenges on zombies, extinct a battlefield just stuff like that which can be entertaining and i can put out more often than general commentaries although unfortunately i will have to hold those up for a bit because i don't have the un uninterrupted time to be able to do it because i really need to be either in the house when it's just one parent here or whatever and i can't quite do that at the moment because i'm still at school but in a couple of weeks to two three weeks time i'll be on school holidays and i'll be able to get this content recorded and i can start putting it out but i'm not going to try and rush anything now and just put out half ass commentaries or stuff like that but anyway guys this has been the gardener gamertag and i'll see you on another video